four VCT Pacific teams made their way to Los Angeles to compete at champions. I'm really excited for this tournament. I'm so faces. From this point on, only one thing matters winning the champion's trophy. Champions is the culmination of your year. It is the final precipice to greatness where if you can have a strong tournament there, it doesn't matter how things necessarily went for you during your IL, during you know, the Masters events leading up to it. This was the time for you to be able to turn around your year and shut down all of the naysayers. <laughs> feeling thank you. I'm feeling lonely. The stage feels pretty like a cozy compared to the other tournament. How do you feel about Fnatic? They yeah, are the strongest team in the world, but uh, we want to show the all power in the biggest stage. I think everybody was excited to see Zeta Division making their way back over onto an international stage. We missed them at Masters Tokyo. So seeing them make it to champions after winning the LCQ was still a great feeling for everybody. The champions are just a I think Wiley T1 was kind of one of these teams that was looking to use champions as a bit of a redemption point. They had a third place finish in Pacific, were only able to pick up a single match victory over at Masters Tokyo. But as we entered into champs and that opening matchup came through against Foot, it just didn't look like the stars were aligning quite yet. What, what's the T1 vibe? T1 vibe? Give them all. <laughs> more. The flank is on its way, and that will do it. 13 to 7. An incredible debut for the side of Foot as they take their opening series 2 and 0, barely breaking a sweat. He's going to have to push past the Cosmic Divine, the fourth and the fifth! The faithful shall be rewarded! Fnatic take down Zeta! We were playing in the Master Touch and we were going to be able to win a team. We know that they were going to win a team. 出来上がったぞ、チキ。で、今アンデス順番はこれは無理が。チキ順番は無理が。ナティック本当に世界一のチームなんで、まあ、負けたんですけど、学べるところはそこがすごかったんで、まあ、この負けを生かして次の試合、
やりきたなという気持ちも僕はあります。I think ultimately for Zeta Division, this is a bit of a bittersweet year. So I'm hoping that, that we get to see Zeta once again at more international competition going into next season. Now we're facing elimination, right? So the pressure is going to be high for both teams. T1 has the momentum coming from the lower bracket. Getting that win, kind of getting that surge of energy that the team needed in order to make this happen. But on the other hand, Foot just looks like the better team, at least when we go back to the original game. <laughs> Carpe and Munchkin in such an uphill battle. But they take the first step, the second. No way. Carpe out of his mind. Look how close. Oh, Carpe! They found out a captain. He's taken one. Carpe! But Moj moves closer. Oh, Carpe! Can you believe it? That's all they need to pick, and they don't get it. And Fallen is coming online with three. Living it all down to Carpe. And this man went big before, but this is a lot to ask of anyone. He's fallen and foot. The first Turkish team to make it this far in these tournaments, but my God, T1. I think it's really surprising from the regular season. And then we just like, till we came here, it's really like long journey. And then I'm actually so proud of my team. And then I should be proud of myself too. But it's really sad that we just like uh, end our uh, year Act like this. Will be just fine, gentlemen. Right. Don't ever give on. 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 Don't ever give 끌고 온 것도 너네가 어떻게 보면 이 전경기보다 훨씬 더 뭔가 보였다 생각을 해 얘들아 물론 져서 아쉽지만 그래도 알잖아 이게 다 과정이야 과정 얘들아 결국 진짜 다 과정일 뿐이야 이거 근데 너네들 최소 얻은 게 있다고 니들 진짜 자, 자랑스럽다고 진짜 얘들아 진짜야 진짜 나 고생했고 진짜 고생했으니까 너 박수 치자 맞아 진짜 진짜 고생했어 얘들아 진짜 고생했어 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 진짜 T1 players might be disappointed, but ultimately I think that there's a lot to be positive about. I think that there was a lot of growth for them, and I think that there is still a lot more growth that can come through going into the next season. Find one, the approach from behind, Artis mows them down, and he drags them over the line! 13 to 5, this time it is not going the distance. Energy, put their foot down, they say you will not take us to three, and we will send you home once again. 비록 저희가 한국에 일찍 돌아가지만 그만큼 빨리 쉬고 챔피언스를 준비할 수 있기 때문에 그것 또한 또 장점이라고 생각을 하고 있습니다. 
많이 실망스러운 대회라고 생각하고 저희 팀이 그때 당시 조금 상황 자체가 좀 어려운 상황이었다고 저는 생각을 하는데 그런 거에서 좀 이겨내지 못하고 좀 극복하지 못해서 개인적으로는 조금 실망스러웠던 대회였던 것 같습니다. For DRX, this was a chance at redemption to try and turn around what was otherwise a bit of a disappointing year for them. So this was a chance to course correct everything that had gone wrong for them during the season. And then we saw the group of death. Group stage, I saw them and I saw them. 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 Pretty much everybody that was paying attention to the DRX was who is going to be in the starting five. And then when we got to champions, we saw that they had rested on bringing Zest back into the roster. Pacific was quickly entering, but I had a bit of a match before, so I was happy. 저는 이제 팀적으로는 문제 없으니까 넌 교전만 이기면 된다 뭐 이런 말을 하셨었거든요. 그래서 약간 교전을 늘리는데 집중했고 제스 형도 어느 정도의 롤 체인지가 있었는데도 그것도 잘 어, 해줘서 너무 고맙다라는 생각이 많이 들어요. 바이퍼를 처음 했을 때는 당연히 저도 못했었어가지고 명관이 걸 참고 많이 했던 것 같고 그리고 약간 스크림을 되게 많이 해보면서 하나 하나 좀 깨달아 나갔던 것 같고 그렇게 연습을 해 나갔던 것 같습니다. After taking down Loud, DRX had to go up against Navi, a team that they were very familiar with when it came down to playing against the core squad. And things kicked off already with an overtime. Just gonna be so much to deal with. Buzz killed himself! Falls to his own nade, but Zest makes it okay! DRX are gonna take a lead in overtime, and holy smoke, Zest. Okay. I mean, Mako's in so much trouble, but Buzz! Hey. He's got the One ult! I mean, they've wiped the floor with Navi! Putting him away! Buzz with three! DRX for playoffs bound! With playoffs secured for DRX, they drew Billy Billy as their first opponent, a team that had already been making waves in the tournament, having taken down NRG twice in a row. I've watched and cast a lot of Valorant, but I don't know if I'll ever witness something like this ever again. This is such a devastating scoreline, DRX. YZ in a 1v3, make that a 1v2. The timing is not great, as DRX finally get a second. Nice! Okay, 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 he gets it to half, finishes the job. And the timing, no idea what's on the other side, and Mako reads it well. Stacks in a 1v1, pulls off, and the snaps from Stacks is good! What a clutch! And BLG are down in numbers, they're down in control, and they're finally down on Lotus. And RB not giving up an inch, looking for the second. Beyonce there on the trade, but Boss finishes it once more. DRX gets a map point. Let's go, DRX! There's not enough time here. They've got to find success on this. The openers have to be clean. And Buzz, of course, it's Buzz who's here. And Mako with three. The pit goes down. And so do BLG's hopes of winning this map. Four for Mako. A 13 to 10 win and a ferocious comeback on Lotus for DRX. Going to be able to hold it the whole way. There was not enough. RB sticks it, DRX survives the best possible shot that BLG throw their way in advance. A lot of people thought DRX was not going to show up at this tournament, but they've changed that script completely. Everybody back again behind DRX. And for DRX finding themselves with their next matchup being against EG, it was one of the roughest situations they could possibly be in. 그때 당시에 패자조의 페나틱이 기다리고 있었어가지고 EG 경기를 정말 이겨야 한다고 생각했거든요. 진심을 다해서 임했는데 아쉽게 됐던 것 같습니다. 오늘 컨셉 알지? 아까 얘기했지? 어차피 이기든 지든 오늘이 마지막 경기잖아. 오늘이야 말로 진짜 싸우다 죽어라 한번 많이 들어봐야 돼. 오케이. 후회 없는 경기를 해보자고. 야, 형이 지금 중진 후회 나간 거야. 지금. 야, 모든 선수들이 꿈꾸는 챔스 와가지고 여기까지 왔잖아? 좀더 나아가려면 우리가 좀더 잘해보자고. 
호의 없이 하자 진짜 나는 그거보다 더 공격적일 수 없다 정도 마인드로 얘네가 공격적으로 나왔습니다 저도 생각... 맞으면서 지지 말고 싸우다 있어 <웃음> 엄마가 그랬어 네 체인 보면 맞고 오지 말고 아마... 때리고 오라고 아, 아, 올라갑시다 네 왜요? And how long does he wait? How patient is he? Oh. It's connected. He knows the flash connected, but he's done everything. And now he gets started toying with him, teasing, and he gets him. Stacks with an audacious, outstanding round. And it's all Alpha, a one v two, and the time is not on his side. Thirteen to one. DRX besting Fnatic on map one. Slipping ahead, stacks though. Thought well, he got a bit of timing there on Leo. He didn't, and no one got the drop on Durka. There we go. Brilliant mental reset from map one. Coming back out, firing on all cylinders. This game deserved a third, and we are going the distance. Double swing happens, Marco, the magician again, pulling! What? But it's still down to the 1v1. Can he find Boaster? Doesn't see him for the first, the second. Boaster's got him! Grip on the go, and it's down to just two. Make it one. Stax has to just stand and accept his fate. Yes, Fnatic proven to be human. That they do indeed bleed. But DRX were not enough to deal the fatal blow. And heartbreak for DRX here to go out like this. 저희가 좀 어려운 한 해를 보내면서 이렇게 챔피언스까지 올라왔는데 작년에 비해서 좀 많이 아쉬운 결과이지만 그래도 완전 끝이 아니고 또 내년도 남아 있기 때문에 아쉬운 건 훌훌 털어내고 내년을 위해서 조금 에너지 충전을 하고 와야겠다라는 생각을 했습니다. And with DRX eliminated now from champions, all hopes. All dreams from Pacific fans rested on the shoulders of Paper X. Let's go for a map select. All right, coach, map select. Let's go. Coach, and we're bringing our IGL. IGL. You are Petro? Yeah, you go. Yeah, yeah, follow them. Hey, IGL. For Paper X, there's a lot more hope for this team. And for something in particular, that stress had to be tenfold for the rest of the team because we didn't get to see him in Masters Tokyo. So many people's attention was trained on something with his international debut at Champions. I think having Ilya back in the team was like easier for everybody because we have been practicing with Ilya for the past few months uh, since Pacific. So we just play our own game and just focus on trying to win and have fun. Adventure. Kang Kang falls. It's Paper X in control. Lovely response. Ready for it. And something Whoa! in their faces. Be known sees no connection. Spam through, but a crossfire is too damn good. For Paper X, it was a really breezy start to the tournament. Back to back 2 0 to get qualified into the playoffs right away. We also have never played loud before, so it will be like a new thing. So I was really excited to see. How the 2022 uh, World Champions were like? The Lotus game we started so badly. I thought I thought we were gonna get zero two, you know. Still locked down the flank with the ADS Bulldog. Bad time for a reload. Something definitely winnable. Pushing back and away. Something wins it out. It took a one v four from Ilya for us to wake up, you know. Before Ilya won 1v4 and then we started stringing rounds back. A lot of heroics that game. Some amazing calls. I think I think that game was all about Ilya. I think uh, he he had a masterclass of a game. But it was a, yeah, it was a super difficult game. My nerves got the better of them, I think. Unless you do not stand a chance. Paper X had no intentions of slowing down. They take down foot, they take down loud and they got poised for a rematch against evil geniuses in the upper final. Compared to Tokyo, I felt like they improved, but we also improved, so it was a really close game, and the first game, we came out on top. Gets the follow-up on Lebusio, something, no way. Yes! No way! Gets the knife into the back and twists it! Do they expect the Mayan guard, and the answer is going to be yes, but he still comes up with three! What is that spray? Still going to be in the hands of the Mayan, tries to play off the back of his own flag, ends up getting gunned oh! down, but my Frank! One, two, three! Shuts them down! Something looking to play entry the spam across, takes him low, finds one, gets a oh! and the transfer comes in! The turret here, something, oh! shuts him down, Forsaken fights Busio, and now it's all on Demon 1! Mind Freak about to swing the corner, he does so, and he puts him down!
we're getting to grand final and it's already great for us and I think no matter who we fight later we just try our best and we try to take the trophy I think this time so yeah. Crazy bout between Loud and EG. EG scraped by with a victory, giving us our third matchup of Paper X EG, but this time it's for a champion's trophy. And it's time to get this started. It is Paper Rex versus Evil Geniuses in a best of five series for the crown. One last series to end the year here in LA. And it's time for the Valorant Champions Grand Finals to start, everyone. Give it up! Let's go, boys! Let's go, let's go. Top side of things to fall. Oh, 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 come on! This guy is literally inhuman. I don't know what this man is made of. Divide or not, he's got to go. He takes down Com, but the trade for Jorgamo is there. EG. When you lose a round, bro, I don't want to hear like, oh, I want to hear. Not bad, nice try. Let's go again, next round, next round, next round, let's get next round. But we win all the VO5s, right? Let's Go guys. Let's okay, go let's, guys. let's go zero two boys to the DRX. <laughs> Hold on, yeah, a little bit of vengeance. Best served. Something waiting on the crop. Disrespecting all the utility, all the presence. Something on the follow up, and the site maybe there's one stands in there. Wow! Oh my God! Just oh, got him out of the sky! How did he just land that? A 2v2 now on the side. Bushio and Com trying to keep control. Swing, a miss. Com on the trade, but he finds Forsaken. It's a shot down. It's huge. Something is bleeding! Oh, but he's still standing and still go. fighting. Oh, they want to tie up the series. Get us back to a 1-1 one, one scoreline. Paper X. Map 2 says. Trying to isolate towards Ethan, but Demon one has got him. Follow up. Oh! Freak looks dead to right, he is! Oh, Jogamo! Unbelievable performance! And now it's all on Jing, and it's not going to happen! Demon 1 signs it, EG delivers it! Okay, on the tag, right? I need to spam the, the box. You know when you go in, there's a box, the square. Spam that one, yeah. spam the corner that we always use to clutch. Okay. Yeah, to spam a little bit, because the guy's always there. EG, Paper X, they're gonna have to dig a lot deeper than this, Pansy and Hypoc, if they want to force a map 5. Look, we have been in this position before, 0-2, it doesn't matter. I'm very sure you guys will make many, many finals in your life, okay guys? Alright, let's have the best time we can possibly have, okay guys? Boys! Go boys! Go boys! It's harder for them. Showstopper goes above, but he's still gonna catch Com for the reveal. Couldn't make the most of it there, Demon 1, this is great from Paper X, holding this together. Bustio and Ethan. Ethan staying close, overwhelmed, Jinx in there! And now all on Bustio in a 1v5, Paper X! Standing strong together here! Taken away from it, Forsaken with a second attempt, the look who's here! Point. You didn't turn around, you didn't check behind you! And of course, come and Demon 1 in unison! He's desperate for it! Can he save Paper X? Not today! 12 on the board! EG! Try and step into the ring. Demon one on the other side. Ethan's found Mike Freak is down to two. This could be it. Another chance for Jing. It's all over. EG are your Valorant World Champions. They did step up in my eyes as well, Paper. It's obviously heartbreaking for them, heart wrenching. play like it's like my hundred percent no way I mean I can play better but at this moment it's like a lot of pressure it's champions it's grand final it's my first time but anyway overall I think I can play more better than today so I mean just 
Give me time, that's it. Thank you. PRX, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us today. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, everyone. まあ、きつい1年だったけど、まあ、ここまで来られたことはあのよかったというかみんな頑張ったなっていうのは感じました個人としてもパフォーマンスはやっぱ良くなかったんで心残りはすごいありましたねちょっとなんだろうな、まあ、悔しい1年だったのは間違いないです I didn't win like a major or anything like masters or champions but I think Overall, it has been really successful one or two years, so no regrets and very happy. Uh, I trolled troll the veto and the map 5, I think. I really think I messed it up.、Uh, I think that was a big regret. I was a little bit of a mess, and I was a little bit of a mess. In 2018, I was a little bit of a mess. 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 앞으로 조금 더 노력해서 성장하는 팀 선수가 되도록 하겠습니다. Looking back on the season, it's been fantastic across the board. Getting to interact with all of the different crowds in Japan, in Los Angeles, in Thailand for Ascension. It has just been a magical year. And I'm very much excited and looking forward to where next season will take us all.